Hi, I'm Sean Michael Reagan, and you're watching Cool Tools. About a year ago, Donald had Jordan Bunker on the show, and he recommended this product, the Original Thread Checker, which is a tool that lets you identify both male and female threads by checking them against a physical reference. So let's say the Fintuzzler nut has fallen off my horseless telegraph, but fortunately I still have the bolt here. And it looks like about 5, 16, 18. No, maybe not. So, maybe it's fine threaded? That'd be 5.16.24. Nope. So, maybe it's metric. Ah, here it is. Now, I'll just replicate an M8 by 1.25 Fentuzler nut, and I should be good to go. And, of course, had the genders been swapped here, I could have used the opposite end of this tester to measure the threads on this nut. This is a fantastic product, and you'll find it linked in the description field down below as usual. But today, I want to make a little pitch for… the wall-mounted version. If, like me, you have a hard time throwing stuff away, it pays to stay organized so your hoard remains an asset rather than a liability. Threaded fasteners make up a large part of this junk pile, and having a handy means to quickly identify them is a huge time-saver. The wall-mounted thread checker is more expensive than the original, but it also has more features and is, I think, much better suited to this kind of application. It measures 3 inches wide by 39 inches tall, and, like the original version, features both male and female reference threads in a range of standard SAE and metric sizes. It's mounted on a half-inch thick plastic composite board, and the printing is both grease and waterproof. It has three 5 16 inch diameter mounting holes for attaching it to the wall, and it is made in the USA by the same folks who make the original thread checker, SNW Manufacturing of Chicago. Unlike the original, the wall-mounted version can be used one-handed, which lets you quickly find a particular size in a bin of unsorted fasteners, or identify an unknown thread with one hand while you hold an assembly in the other. It also has a slightly larger range than the original thread checker, covering both 91612 and 91618 SAE, whereas the original version stops at the half-inch SAE sizes. Finally, the wall-mounted thread checker has a screw diameter tester at the bottom that goes all the way down to number 0 SAE, as well as both metric and SAE rulers, along the bottom edges for measuring fastener length. Okay, thank you for watching. As always, you'll find affiliate links down below the video. If you've seen anything here you like, please do check those links out, as well as our blog and our podcast over at cool-tools.org. We'll see you next time.